सो नमस्कार मंडे फ्रेंड्स आता आपण आज मी मेडिटेशन जे देणार आहे ना ते त्याचं आहे की रिमेंबरिंग हाऊ फॉर्च्युनेट यू आर तर आपण का वी कीप ऑन स्ट्रायव्हिंग टू अक्वायर न्यू थिंग्स फोकसिंग ऑन वॉट वी डोंट हॅव कम्पेअरिंग ॲगनायझिंग नॉट नोटिसिंग how precious the human life is it is at the back of our mind but this meditation is to bring it to the front burner this is the first and profound buddhist teaching itar dharma madhe pan sangitlela ahe buddhist Buddhism specially focuses on it. Now this meditation, I have learned the basic from Kimberly Brown. So, sit comfortably. In a position that you can hold for next 10 minutes. close your eyes or gaze down away from your feet to avoid distraction prepare prepare your mind and heart by paying attention to what is happening in this moment grounding yourself in the present moment you can always be in reality if you pay attention to your senses the air on your face allowing light to enter your eyes allowing sound entering ears smell entering the nose feeling the belly feeling the weight of your body relaxing shoulders noticing that you are breathing now i would like to place one hand on the belly notice the belly is rising as you breathe in and flattening with exhale start counting your breath count five breaths one inhale and one exhale is one if you get distracted or lost come back again we are starting whenever you decide to come join us one inhale and one exhale is count one develop the capacity 
to come back. If you get distracted, start from one again. This practice helps you to stay focused. Stay there for a minute. Bring attention to the belly. Relax your shoulders. Now, if it helps you, put one hand on your belly and the other hand on your heart. Listen. Start recognizing two circumstances in life. One is that you are born human, not an animal or any other creature. You have the capacity to learn and develop your heart and mind. You can ask for help when needed. You can practice meditation. Learn to be mindful. Keep your body healthy. You have enough intelligence to practice and contemplate. Excuse me, can you, can we all mute yourself? You can remember the past and plan for the future. Everything is given to you by being born as human. You have time. You don't have to walk miles to get water. You have electricity an abundance of information is at your doorstep. The internet, the libraries, the teaching is available from people near and far. You are born at the right time. When all these gifts are available, just think about it. Then you are not living in a place devastated by natural desire, disasters or war. Your heart is melted when you see this suffering and you have ability and capacity to help.
none of the other beings can do all that we can do. Now the second point is that you are here showing inclination, interest and understanding that you have precious life. that very few human beings on this planet have. That you can use your thoughts, behaviors to benefit others and not harm them. Let this thought sink in you. You are on a journey. If your mind is quiet and focused, you can see and learn much more. You have limitless capacity. You are here just to cultivate what you have. Let's end this by few lines of Zen Master. I'm paraphrasing. He says, Let me respectfully remind you that life and death are supremely important. Time swiftly passes by. An opportunity is lost. Awaken. Take heed. Do not squander your precious human life. So friends, May you all be content and happy in this human life. May all beings be content and happy. Thank you for practicing meditation with me. Thank you, Anaga. This was wonderful. Thank you. Again, uh, we all are working uh, for uh, healthy, becoming healthy, and health is something that will uh, result in peace and uh, uh, at the individual level and also at the group level and overall at the world peace level. So uh, one of the techniques for uh, the health that we are going to talk about is acupressure. Uh, so let me just put the slides on. <clears throat> Again, there are many different techniques. <clears throat> for health, achieving health. You can practice yoga. You can, the Ayurveda is also one of the uh, uh, ways of uh, achieving health. Okay. So again, uh, my name is uh, Shrikant Sabnis. We are going to talk about acupressure. And I want to thank Dr. Ravindran. <laughs> uh, so many of this information that you will see is from Dr. Ravindran. <laughs> I uh, wanted to check with you if any one of you has actually attended any session by Dr. Ravindran. Okay. So he generally the sessions are for like uh, five, six hours you know, for 
uh, first two, three hours, you know, he talks about the, uh, the, uh, <clears throat> the theory, and then uh, he actually, you know, uh, asks and uh, helps people. Uh, and uh, I actually attended one of his sessions where uh, somebody had a shoulder issue and he couldn't raise his shoulder. And then he presses one point on the hand and uh, then that person is able to lift the uh, that shoulder um, up and down okay and uh, so i mean you know the, the there is also uh, one person uh, who said you uh, he, he just wanted to see what the doctor ravindran is going to say and he said i have diabetes and he just presses one point and say you don't have any problem your uh, blood sugar is right now 110 so you don't have any problem okay so uh, that kind of level is uh, very high. Uh, I'm certainly not at any level uh, like that. And uh, uh, I just want to give you an introduction to what is acupressure. And uh, I had shared that information. Let me just uh, stop here for a minute. So, so that uh, I had shared some information which included <coughs> a handout <coughs> which talks, which has a kind of, you know, this gives you a basic idea about what uh, acupressure is and uh, all the different points in it uh, uh, on your hands and uh, also on your uh, same points are on the feet also. And then uh, for different uh, diseases, uh, what points you need to press. So that is one thing. Then I also shared the books. These are books by uh, Dr. Vora. And uh, Ravindran is actually uh, one of his disciples. And uh, these books uh, uh, have a lot more information in addition to acupressure uh, for, uh, for health. Uh, but these names of these books are uh, Health in Your Hands. And uh, I had posted the information and uh, Saili again uh, posted that information today. Okay. So, uh, uh, and the other thing is, you know, there is some, uh, uh, <clears throat> tools that you can use. Uh, these tools are not necessary, uh, but uh, it's easy. So this is a kind of a tool. I hope you can see this. Uh, so for if you want to activate uh, uh, pressure points on the palm hands, and you can just use this, uh, do this for a few minutes and so on. And this one is the foot roller. Uh, you know, you uh, put your, if in a, you can sit in a chair, put your feet, uh, put this under the uh, feet and then roll uh, back and forth uh, for a few minutes. Uh, and this is again uh, activating the points, uh, uh, ball with, you know, pointed things. Uh, again, uh, uh, what, uh, this exactly same thing may not be available. I uh, sent a link uh, from Amazon and that link uh, may have slightly different uh, tools, but these tools are not uh, uh, needed as such. Now you can do it uh, just with uh, using a pen or something like that. So anyway, so let's go back to the sharing the screen. <clears throat> All right. Uh, so uh, again, this is my name is Shrikant Sabnis. Uh, uh, <clears throat> let's talk about uh, acupressure. Okay. So the agenda is what is acupressure, uh, how does acupressure work, any specific uh, ac acupressure points. There are 38 points that are uh, uh, suggested, uh, that are included, uh, and uh, uh, there is information in these books about those uh, 38 points. And uh, how does the healing happen, and then any suggested, uh, what practice is suggested on a daily basis. So. Acupressure is an ancient uh, method from uh, India. Uh, uh, the book uh, and Ravindran says it's about 5,000 years old. And uh, that uh, acupressure uh, uh, technique uh, was uh, by uh, Buddha monks were, uh, was uh, uh, carried forward to China and other places. And, uh, then actually it became more popular acupressure and then acupuncture became more, more popular in China. Uh, but uh, originally this uh, uh, technique is from India 
and uh, basically you know it is uh, you know based on uh, uh, so, uh, again uh, i have seen the other books with uh, not just the palms but different points in the body uh, for using acupressure but uh, the techniques that are in these uh, books by dr vora are specifically for uh, pressure points in the hands and uh, also on the feet okay. and uh, um, even on the next slide you'll see that uh, uh, just uh, pressing these points uh, will help you to stimulate all different organs and endocrine glands and so on in the body and uh, this can be uh, can be used to uh, certainly for detection of uh, problems and also for uh, uh, fixing the problems okay. and uh, 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 this works at the energy level so what this means is uh, uh, you have a physical body and also you have a subtle body and it's uh, when you are pressing this it's just not happening at the physical level but actually think that there is a, a connection uh, from uh, from this particular point to that organ in the body and uh, so uh, whatever you are doing is affecting that particular organ okay. uh, you will see that on the next chart so uh, i don't know if you can see the entire screen uh, uh, <clears throat> especially the uh, uh, the diagram that's on the right side uh, so basically, you see those uh, 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 <coughs> lines. Uh, sorry, <coughs> I think I messed up. <coughs> okay, so uh, you'll see those uh, lines that go from the hands. So from hand, there are five lines that go all over the body, up to the head, and also they come back all the way down to the feet, and. Uh, uh, this is a representation uh, uh, that uh, uh, that energy is flowing from the tip of the fingers, move through, moving throughout the body, and ending in the tips of the toes. And, uh, and uh, on the, in that uh, flow, just like you know, if you have any major uh, uh, <clears throat> appliance, then there are ways that uh, you can switch it off on, and if there is a more uh, you know, uh, uh, if, if if there is a short circuit, then uh, to prevent damage to that uh, appliance, you now there are uh, mechanical mechanisms that uh, uh, certain switches can be turned off automatically. Fuses uh, that uh, will uh, avoid the uh, short circuits, and uh, you know you can restart uh, uh, that that particular appliance. So in similar way. Uh, the ener if the energy is flowing all properly through all these channels, then everything is fine. Uh, but if some malfunction uh, happens, then there will be a blockage uh, in, of the flow, and that will be reflected in the uh, uh, switch points uh, uh, um, uh, that are in the palms or on the feet. Okay. And uh, by using this acupressure techniques you know, we can uh, activate and uh, uh, remove or control the blockages that uh, are affecting the flow so that's the basic idea okay. and uh, so next i'm showing uh, uh, th again this information was in the in, in the handouts that i provided uh, so there are uh, 38 points, uh, both on the hands and also on the feet. Uh, so just to give you a general idea, uh, your body has a right side and left side. And the left hand uh, is associated with the points on the left side of the body. So if you have left shoulder, then there is a point for the shoulder, but on the if you press it on the left side, a uh, left hand, then that is related to the left shoulder. There is a similar point on the, on the right side, right hand for the right shoulder. Uh, uh, again, uh, you saw the diagram where you know, the from the hand, the it's going all the way up and also to the feet. So left hand 
and left foot. So if there is some problem with the left hand and you cannot use the left hand, you can always use the left foot. So they are redundant. You can use either the left hand or left foot or use both. Uh, and uh, also there is the front side of the body and also back side of the body. So the spine is considered as something on the back side. And so not from the front of the head, from the back of the head, uh, hand, <clears throat> this uh, particular point uh, between the thumb and the index finger on the back side, this is related to the spine. So, uh, so think of it that you know, there are points which are uh, in the right side of the body, uh, control the right side of the body, some control the left side of the body, then the back side and the front. And uh, then uh, as you know that there are some uh, uh, organs which are only on the left side or the right side. So you'll see that, um, for example, heart is only on the left side. Uh, so you'll see this uh, point number 36 uh, on this uh, chart, which is about the heart. And below it is spleen, so heart and spleen, so point number 36 and 37, they are only on the left side. And uh, the liver is on the right hand side, and also the gallbladder is also on the right hand side. Appendix is also just on the right side. <clears throat> so uh, that's a general idea about uh, how the points are and where they are. Uh, uh, we'll go into you know, uh, again, the, the book has the information. I will go into uh, how to, you know, activate those points and so on. And also just a general idea, uh, you'll see that uh, the, on the thumbs, uh, the, the points related to the brain uh, and overall, uh, just the, uh, uh, your face and the, up to the throat, uh, uh, the points are on, the, on your thumb. Okay. And uh, uh, again, the, the ears and uh, ears and eyes are on the other fingers. Uh, but the, uh, many of these uh, uh, endocrine glands and also the nervous system, uh, neck, uh, throat, uh, they are on, on the uh, close, either on the thumb or close to the thumb, followed by, you know, this, uh, this uh, big mount is the thyroid and parathyroid. And uh, as I mentioned, backside is the, uh, uh, the spine. And then uh, near the wrist, these are points related to the sexual organs. Uh, uh, and also in the center, there is uh, lymph nodes. Uh, so the uh, points related to the lymph nodes. And then on the left side of the palm, uh, there are, so as I mentioned, heart and spleen or left side and uh, uh, the other you know, liver uh, <clears throat> and gallbladder on the right side. And also there are some other points like shoulder and hip joint. And then the basic point in the, the, the center is all the Madhya Pradesh or can I call it uh, uh, your uh, <clears throat> basic uh, organs that are in from the chest uh, to the abdomen and so on. So all the you know, uh, 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 stomach and uh, bladder and the colons and so on all that uh, are in the central part and they are common to both both hands. Okay. Uh, so that gives a, a general idea about what those points are. Uh, again, uh, this is kind of uh, uh, not, uh, I have not understood the complete logic of this, but some are related to the uh, organs, uh, some points, then there are some points related to the endocrine glands and so on. But also there are some points which just say, and so for example, here the point number 34 is for cold. Then the, there is a point that is uh, for piles. So there are some points or, or the, the, ta, the, the tips of the fingers are for sinus points. So there are some points which are uh, you know, uh, identified for specific issues uh, uh, rather than uh, uh, a specific organ uh, or uh, uh, some functionality within the body. Uh, so that gives you a general idea. Let me see what's on the next slide. 
So uh, these are uh, all the endocrine glands and associated with the um, different uh, chakras. Uh, and many of you, you know, uh, that are familiar with the uh, yoga and uh, overall the you know, the uh, the subtle body which has all these uh, chakras, uh, then this is giving you a mapping of the chakra to the particular uh, uh, organ associated and also the the point that is uh, associated with it. So uh, these are the starting with the Muladhar chakra all the way down at the bottom. Uh, then there is a you know, Swadishtan Chakra, Manipur Chakra, Anahata Chakra, and so on. Uh, and they are associated with the, the Muladhar Chakra is associated with the sex glands, uh, uh, the Swadishtan with the, uh, again, there may be some differences uh, in uh, what is here and uh, what I have learned from different sources. Uh, but anyway, just the solar plexus, uh, you know, the Swadishtan Chakra, uh, could be uh, Manipur Chakra uh, is also considered as associated with the solar plexus. So anyway, uh, there may be some difference between what is the uh, it in the acupressure documents and uh, uh, some other uh, views on uh, yoga. Uh, uh, but it doesn't matter. You, know, you will still you kind know, of have a, a general idea and. Uh, uh, <clears throat> Uh, if you instead of one point you press another point, there's nothing bad is going to happen about that. So that's the beauty of uh, uh, of uh, this acupressure technique. So let's say uh, uh, you have uh, on the hand and you are trying to press the point number uh, uh, no one point for uh, thyroid or parathyroid and by mistake you press a different point, uh, nothing bad is going to happen. So that other point may get activated. And uh, uh, so overall, uh, uh, the if you don't have any health issues, uh, then they will uh, suggest that, you know, to, to act like, uh, I think we'll, uh, 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 let's go through the slides and then I think we'll, uh, um, you know, we will, uh, uh, you know, just actually uh, do uh, uh, some practice, uh, and uh, uh, at least I will show you how how to activate those points and so on. So, so this is again, as I mentioned, that the thumb is associated with the uh, <clears throat> points related to uh, the brain and. Uh, the glands that are associated with the uh, kind of close to the brain. So pituitary glands and pineal, pineal gland, uh, those are points number three and four. Brain is point number one. And mental nerves, uh, it is mental nerves actually, you know, it is something related to the jaw bones and that area, the nerves that are in the, that area. Okay. And uh, then the, uh, the head nurse uh, 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 is number five. And then, uh, uh, so this is just giving you an example of uh, uh, what those points are. And uh, also there is some uh, uh, information about uh, uh, how, what it will help, uh, which, which area that will help. Uh, and again, uh, that uh, booklet or the book has a lot more information about uh, the, for the treatments, you know, which points do you use and so on. But this is just an illustration. So something that's uh, affecting uh, any of the hormones, you know, pituitary glands are going to control all different hormones in the body. And so if there is some, uh, any kind of uh, uh, problem with the hormones, uh, uh, then you can uh, use the point number three to activate that pituitary gland. And also there may be more points you know, based on which particular hormones are being affected. Okay. And so uh, uh, all these details are there. Uh, so again, I'm just going through these uh, slides just to give you an uh, idea about uh, how the information, you know, because, uh, 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 it's uh, kind of uh, what's the point number, uh, what is it for, 
how, what kind of treatment it can be, do. And again, it's just showing that particular point. <clears throat> Uh, so this is point number eight, uh, which is the mount uh, uh, under the thumb that is the for the thyroid and parathyroid. And this will help you with the uh, deficiency of calcium, hyper and hy uh, hypothyroid or kidney stones, obesity and so on. <clears throat> Let's go to the next slide. <clears throat> and uh, then again, spleen. Uh, 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 so uh, I'm going fast just to, you know, because these points are just uh, telling you, and uh, I specifically wanted this uh, this slide and the next one to show you that uh, left hand is different from the right hand. So point number 37 on the left hand, uh, that is uh, uh, spleen and it's only on the left hand. And it's related to uh, varicose nerves, uh, leukemia, blood-related issues, and so on. Okay. And uh, point number 38, oh, what happened to point number 38? Okay, so I think I missed one slide, uh, but there's something similar to that on uh, point number 38. And uh, <clears throat> uh, this last slide also, I will just go through it. Uh, so the overall concept is this, that uh, any kind of uh, recovery or kind of healing, uh, uh, first of all, it's not at the physical level. It has to be at a more uh, internal level. Uh, the, uh, just the, uh, uh, just, uh, you know, curing, uh, you know, uh, if you think that it is uh, the problem is just in your hand, or uh, at the physical level or uh, any uh, organ in the body at just at the physical level that's not the case it is uh, uh, the 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 healing has to happen at the more uh, internal level or the or the uh, <clears throat> what do you call the <clears throat> uh, the energy level that it has to happen and uh, uh, you need to have that hope and, and believe and uh, then trust uh, to for that transformation. Okay. <clears throat> so uh, this is just a diagram that's uh, showing you know what's the path uh, from the uh, from the further transformation. Okay. Uh, so I think this is the suggested practice. Uh, uh, we'll go, I'll just go over this and then uh, uh, we'll just uh, uh, actually uh, try to uh, press some points and uh, uh, then I will open it for questions. So the suggested practice is uh, for each of the hands, you know, try to do it for two, three minutes. Uh, uh, again, uh, if, you, if, you, uh, if you just want to exercise all the points, then you can just roll. Uh, and uh, for uh, and again, I will. Uh, I know that because of the slides, you may not be able to see it properly. Uh, 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 but for all the uh, points, you can do it for two, three minutes. Uh, if you want to, if there is some specific problem and you need to work on that specific problem, then uh, also you can press that point uh, for one minute, but not continuously. Just uh, do it for a few seconds, then uh, then again, you know, release and uh, do it for a few more seconds and so on. Uh, again, we'll practice that. And then, uh, as then you try to do this. Uh, if if the if you have a pain, and then look at the point associated with that point. And if the pain after five to fifteen days also doesn't go away, then you need uh, to seek further uh, further help, not the health, uh, but. Uh, uh, to see what exactly needs to be done. So uh, let's, I'm going to stop screen share just to, <clears throat> um, again, you know, we'll, uh, if you have any questions, then we can uh, gonna talk about this, but uh, uh, let's uh, just see uh, uh, how to practice. I, so the, the last slide says the, that, uh, you know, practice it for two, three minutes. So. Uh, it doesn't have to be something like this, but you can just have a, a pen and just 
uh, on one hand, just roll it, start, starting from the from the back side, roll it one side of the hand, the other side of the hand, or even the back of the hand. And same way, do the same thing on the other side. Okay. So uh, that is for the hands. Uh, for the feet, <coughs> You can sit in a chair or sofa, <clears throat> and uh, this uh, goes underneath and just roll forward and back. And uh, you can do this uh, for 10 minutes. <clears throat> you can uh, uh, repeat it in the evening. <clears throat> These uh, these practices are for general, uh, not for any specific point. <clears throat> Both the what we did for the hands and for the feet. Now for the specific points. Now let's say you know this is the uh, thyroid parathyroid, and I want to press this. Uh, there is some problem with it, and so I want to press this. So the way to do this is, you know, you press it for a, uh, some, some time and then release, press it, release, and so on. Okay. And uh, again, uh, there is always going to be a question about how, uh, how much pressure should I give, uh, less or more. And uh, again, the pressure that is uh, suggested is in pounds. So it may be difficult to, you know, uh, uh, for you to, even if you are doing it, but don't do it too hard. And again, uh, let me just uh, uh, try to do this on, on, on this side. Uh, and uh, I'm going to use uh, some music uh, just to, uh, so you will hear one, two, three, four, five. Up to count of five, you are just pressing it in and then release when you hear out. Okay. So it's something like this. One, two, three, four. Sorry. I out. One, two, three, four. Five out, one, two, three, four, five out, one, two, three, four, five out, one, two, three, four, five out, one. Okay, so something like this. And again, uh, you can use the thumb. <clears throat> so at these points, it may be easier to use the thumb. And again, you can uh, press and release and all that, you know, uh, so. Uh, so one time, you know, press, press and release, uh, that will be like five seconds and then continue for about a minute. Uh, and again, that's the last uh, slide said uh, that uh, if you have a pain on the, at a, uh, 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 associated with that point, uh, so again, that, that uh, information is there. So uh, if you have, uh, let's say, uh, if you have a uh, cold, then uh, you know you press point. Uh, all this information is here. So if you have cold, then press points one to seven and also point number thirty-four. And in that case, now if you are you are trying to treat that uh, cold, so each of these points, you press it for one minute. So a uh, points one to seven, and also the point number thirty-four, which is you know, these two fingers here, and the the higher part. And uh, uh, and uh, if that problem, you know, should go away in uh, you know, uh, 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 two three uh, after uh, after doing it two three times two three days, if that doesn't go away, then uh, you know, uh, if it doesn't go after uh, uh, after a few days, then uh, you may need some uh, more treatment. So that's the overall uh, idea. Uh, let me see if I, um, before I open it for questions, is there anything else? Uh, uh, so, uh, some of you know me, uh, we have uh, Shri Yoga, we have uh, 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 all different types of yoga classes, including acupressure. And uh, currently on Thursday evenings, we have acupressure session where uh, Jagdish, you know, conducts these sessions, and uh, so you can actually, uh, you know, see, you know, what he is doing and uh, how it is done, and so on. And uh, 
So uh, and again, you know, so, uh, so that will help you uh, understand uh, how it is done. And he, uh, what he does is you know, he goes through all the points uh, uh, on uh, the thumb and uh, the uh, the fingers uh, uh, one uh, in one session, and then all other points in the other session. So if you attend two sessions, then you will get a complete idea about all the points. All right. Uh, so, Kaka, uh, kai prashna hai. Yeah. Uh, so, some of the questions. One uh, question is, my back does not bend. What point I can use to make it flexible? Yeah. So, you know, the, uh, the there are points associated with the lower back, and you know, just uh, you know, try to press those points and see if that works. Okay. 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 Uh, another question: Which points are associated with ankle and heel pain? So, uh, ankle. Uh, <clears throat> so uh, the the points that are uh, that's a, uh, uh, so the uh, the points that are uh, related to uh, uh, these are the uh, the points that I have here are in the hands, but uh, uh, for the feet, uh, you know, they close to the. Points that show for the hip joints, you know, this, there are similar points uh, on the feet, and then those will be for the ankles. Okay. Okay. Uh, Rekha Devdar, you have a question. You can go ahead. Oh, um, okay. Okay. Ha no, 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 actually. So, the, the, so you are not uh, doing this. You are not uh, doing this. I don't know if you can see it. It's more like, you know, you press it like this. Yeah, but I uh, I, I think you know if you are not doing this, so nakhal lam dari asla, okay. Tari sula this part of the thumb that you are using it. Okay, okay. You are not using the nail part. So nail is not even touching when you are trying to do this. Okay. Kadi kadi chitran madhe asa kadi ista ke angtha asa pagdi. Okay. The, the other thing you can do is something like this. You can use it. Okay. okay. So instead of the instead of using the thumb, oh, okay. you can use a kind of a, not a pointed thing. Uh, okay. So uh, 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 something that's uh, round and uh, just press it. Okay. That can be done. Okay. 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 Um, <laughs> That's a good uh, good way uh, good way to do this. Uh, uh, it doesn't have any pointers on uh, points, right? It is just more flat. So the points may not get activated. So okay. okay. Uh, uh, yeah. Um, this is such a simple device. Yeah. Um, Oh, ball Exactly. Yeah, that's, uh, okay. Yeah, device. Okay. Very yeah. nice. Thank you. Thank you for sharing it. And, uh, 
Uh, it is not part of the acupressure techniques that they are described here, but that certainly is something that uh, is, uh, I'm sure it is helpful and uh, it's a different technique, but I think you know, thank you for sharing so that you know, people can use it. Uh, and there are you know, different ways of uh, uh, using the, you know, uh, 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 the balls to uh, you know, uh, activate or you know, reduce the pain for certain points. And certainly, okay. Is Even there the, some space between the two tennis balls? Sorry, I just wanted to clarify. It doesn't matter. No, sir. Probably it doesn't matter. So, okay. Yeah. I will say, uh, I'm sure there'll be some space, but not too much space. Okay. Sabnis Kaka, there are yes. a few questions about the roller. So, one okay. is, does it have to be a wooden roller for foot? And also, can you show foot roller closely? Does it have spikes and where to buy it? Okay, uh, so uh, I don't know if you can see this. Ha, ha, ha. this. So this one does have uh, points, kind uh, of the kind of toka toka slalet. Ani hai lakda I uh, it used to be on uh, Amazon, but uh, recently you know, I had was planning to send you, you know, two links, uh, but the ones that are uh, wooden, uh, I didn't see them on the link. Uh, so let me again check you know, if the wooden uh, rollers are available easily. I'm sure they are available in India, uh, yeah. but whether they are available on Amazon or some some place nearby, uh, and I will uh, you know try to post that uh, answer in the in our uh, group. Okay, but uh, uh, these uh, again these do have points, uh, so can kind of uh, you can see. Uh, <clears throat> And uh, um, there are also, uh, I, I don't know if you have seen, there are uh, uh, sandals uh, that are wooden sandals with uh, points yes. on it. Okay. So just using those uh, sandals uh, is another way of automatically, you know, uh, um, activating those points. Okay. <laughs> TJ Maxx मधे की वह रास मधे ऐसे मिलते हैं पायला ये प्लास्टिक सा है सांगल हाँ अपन बुडन असल तो जास्ता सांगल है बुडन सांगल क्या या आने आजुन प्रश्न है कि राइट साइड साइट का सटी कई पॉइंट्स आहित का आने कितनी बार लगे आने विच पॉइंट फॉर लेफ्ट हिप ये दोन पॉइंट्स चे प्रश्न अच्छा हम जब तो लेफ्ट हिप से पॉइंट में से हिप से so point number 17 is the hip point, uh, which is kind of as a khali bazula left side of the yeah, uh, just little bit uh, under the wrist crease uh, on the left side. If you press it and release, press it and release it. Uh, and if you uh, there also, if you feel the pain, then then you try to do this uh, one minute or even more, and more than one minute. Okay, uh, uh, and uh, uh, see uh, you know, uh, if it relieves some pain. Okay. And again, uh, try to do this uh, for. Uh, 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 I have seen that uh, you know somebody couldn't bend and uh, you know. Uh, uh, the Dr. Ravindran will uh, just press some points and just you know, uh, you know try to press it on, uh, for uh, two minutes, three minutes, and then uh, release, and then that person is able to bend forward. So, <clears throat> okay. mm. in, uh, again, I this is uh, I am not at that level at all, and uh, I'm just uh, uh, giving you introduction to this uh, topic. Yeah, okay. is this okay uh... for the hand? I'm sorry. Is this okay for the hand? Uh, the uh, what is okay? You know, I can't see what here. Oh, one minute. Me, you mala highlight karte. Ha ha. This la mala the, but that is not for the. Uh, yeah, this is fine. That okay. is fine. Thank you. Thank you. <coughs> Thank you, Saili. Ani mala ek parat manje repeat karao swarta apn door session la santo ki apn ya sessions madhe ji kai mahiti cover karto thi please use with caution ask your doctor make sure you're not overdoing anything as kaka said this is all for information only so purja prashna hai ki which points for high blood pressure and high cholesterol 
Okay, again, there are, you know, uh, I think we, we should uh, uh, look at the, the uh, you know, the uh, booklet and so on, uh, book and the information. So, I mean, I'm not going to go into, you know, what is the specific point, uh, but there is uh, information in the book. Uh, so, you know, even Dr. Ravindran will say, read the book and it shows what are the different points uh, for both cholesterol and uh, also for blood pressure and so on. Okay. <clears throat> so uh, let me see if there is something that I obviously hear. Uh, okay. So uh, on this uh, the the hand, handout that I gave for blood pressure, low blood pressure, there are points uh, three, four, eight, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-five, and twenty-eight. For, low, uh, for high blood pressure, uh, use the points 3, 4, 5, 25, and 28. Again, all this is uh, in the chart. And uh, uh, so I would suggest that you uh, both things, you know, buy the book that has more information, uh, not just the acupressure, but some more uh, additional things that you can do. And uh, for, uh, uh, in any case, uh, print the handout and that, that will have enough information for you for for general problems that uh, that what points to use okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, ether pains baddal pan lokanne vicharle so i think what uh, sabnis kaka just said if you have the handout or if you read the book you will get all that specific information okay. uh, sabnis kaka can you share information on dr ravindran uh, so dr ravindran uh, he's from bangalore uh, he's uh, uh, he uh, used to come here uh, uh, you know, once uh, or, uh, uh, a year, uh, and then he will conduct the sessions. But uh, currently, uh, uh, last uh, few years, uh, he has not uh, come here. Uh, he's uh, there is uh, one. Uh, uh, he's a uh, founder of uh, Yantra Foundation. Uh, Yantra, uh, uh, and it stands. Uh, I don't remember all the, but yoga, acupressure, and uh, all, all these you know, letters are in that Yantra Foundation. Uh, he's in Bangalore, and uh, also there is, uh, you know, the in the USA, uh, there is uh, Prema Mysore. She is in uh, Chicago area. Actually, I wanted her to give this talk uh, instead of me giving a talk. That, uh, but. Uh, Unfortunately, this uh, 11 a.m. is not convenient for us, her on any day. And if it is too late, then I think, you know, I had talked to Anagha about it, uh, and uh, then that is, doesn't fit in our, uh, uh, but uh, there is a, uh, an organization, uh, uh, it's called Sanata, and uh, uh, that is for acupressure, the Ravindran's uh, group that is, uh, uh, practicing and helping people in uh, USA, and uh, her name is uh, Prema Mysore. And I can share her contact uh, can I, if you want to get more information from her. And uh, 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 again, she's in uh, Chicago area, uh, but I think she not. Uh, if you have, uh, she, she may be conducting some sessions from there. Yes. Uh... Thank you very much, Sabnis Kaka. Uh, I think uh, that's it for questions. If anybody else has any questions, want to raise your hand and uh, ask a question or comment, uh, we can do that for a few minutes. And then Anagatai, you want to uh, announce next week's session? Yes, I will do that. Prema Mysore's phone number share karal na to me. Yes. Uh, uh, <clears throat> let me do one thing. Attadzarthi uh, third taktala phone number. So uh, her email is uh, P N P as in Peter N as in Nancy Mysore M Y S O R E at gmail dot com. And the phone number is 612-750-6811. Thank you. Sure. <clears throat> and uh, uh, yeah, she's, uh, uh, you know, she's uh, very amazing. Uh, and uh, uh, 
again, uh, I, as I mentioned, that this what I'm telling you is just introduction. Uh, but uh, she uh, has conducted sessions in Washington, D.C. area, and again, like six hour sessions, and some part of it is uh, theory and then uh, followed by practical. And she may be conducting uh, more, uh, you know, uh, uh, of the sessions somewhere else okay. yeah. in, in Chicago, from Chicago. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Sorry. Go ahead. Uh, thank you, Rikanji. Uh, so, what more can I say? That's a Uttam session. Asa, Amitensa Pranayam, Yoga, Surasa, Tajapuru, Occupation Pun, and Sampasa. Thank you very much for that. It's very useful. Ani Ata Pudla Mainasa, me as Sanjakai. I'm going to present Mir Sadhya Kenya Tanzania Safari Karunale and saw lots of animals and how animals and human beings live together with nature and prosper. So uh, I'm not going, that session will not be recorded because oh. some of the pictures I had taken from my colleagues and I don't know which one because they are all mixed up. So it won't be recorded, but how, you, you like it to so see how animals live, where your animals, birds, oh. and what you have, we have lost because of this modern civilization in America, what we have lost. That's what. Then Alka Deshpande's program is there as usual. Any uh, Maya Neil will present on gratitude. Uh, Alka is going to present on all, all good dishes for Thanksgiving. So, all interesting programs as usual in November. All right, so we will see you there. Thank you. Yeah. yeah, so we will see you next week. Uh, till then, bye. And the recording will be available on our WhatsApp group. <clears throat> Thank you. Thank you, Saili. Thank you. Thank you.